Friday afternoon, everybody. I hope you're all having a good day. This is Lori from Lori Lee's Small World. I just wanted to catch up on a few things. Um, that sign that I got from um, Dollar Tree a couple weeks ago is being painted brown, <laughs> dark brown right now. Um, it will go on my walls really pretty that way. Um, I had to mix the paint because I couldn't find brown paint. I didn't have any brown paint, so that's what I've been doing is mixing paint and putting paint on it before I put the, um, decide what I'm going to do with it next. i got to finish it on the sides and stuff. And I wanted to show you an order that I, that I paid for. This is not a, um, what I'm showing you now. This is from, because I know a lot of people get crafts from BB. B E E B E E. This is from BB Crafts Incorporated from um, in Ontario. Looks like Canada, but um, it could be California too, but I don't think so. Anyhow, this is from BB Crafts. Um, they do have a lot of paper products that you can buy, and. Um, this is what I bought. I did, guess what, I bought, bought mesh. Yep, I did. But the colors, some of the colors are a little bit different, but it's some that I needed. They ship it really nice, and, and it's very fast. Very, very fast. I'm sorry if I'm going around here. And uh, this is beautiful. This is 10 inch by 10 yards. So, and it costs me for this 10 inch by 10 yards, which is quite a bit, um, a dollar, it was on sale for a dollar. I think this one, well, this one went in, oh, look on the sheet right here, there it is, this one might not have been on sale, so it was on sale, but, no, it wasn't, it was five dollars and 25 cents. These are the holiday lines, the new holiday lines they have out or whatever. Um, the multicolored line was flo holiday florals, what it's called, and the others were like on sale for two seventy five. Sometimes you can find them on sale for a dollar um, sixty nine, and I grab them up then too. But right now the holidays coming up, it's not going to be. But I thought this was awfully pretty. It'll be pretty for Halloween or. New Year's. I only got one though because it was five dollars and twenty-five cents. So and then I got a just a plain black one. I made that really pretty black and gold beads I love. I think I'm gonna try to make another one like that and I didn't have enough black for that. Or Halloween, I don't know. That one was too uh, just two ninety nine. Um, it's the holiday ones that are. Oh, I'm sorry, I had my finger right there. It's two ninety nine. The holiday ones that are priced up there, and then I got another gold one. Well, they're calling it gold, and it's all these are ten by ten yards, so they come really nice, and they don't fray as much. I think I got, I thought I got, um, okay, this is the holiday ones that I got for Christmas that I thought would be very pretty. That is the striped red and green one in white. I thought it would be really, really pretty, and it's 10 by 10 yards, and that one was five dollars and twenty five cents and then I got this one which I don't know why why they charged me five dollars and twenty five cents for this but anyway um, this is the silver lines that are going through it but it is ten ten yards of mesh so and it is ten inch mesh and those make really beautiful wreaths um, so I got one of those. And then I just got the two white. 
with their two fifty nine. I think they were. But you could find these on sale if you keep looking at theirs or Paper Mart. And you can find them on sale for a dollar fifty nine sometimes off season. And it's getting towards the holiday season, so they're gonna be marked up and they're not gonna go on sale. Anyhow, that's my shopping for the month probably. I don't know if I'll buy any more. I might buy some more, but um, only if I really need it. I, our Dollar Trees have not had any. So all that mesh would sound like a lot to you guys, but it's not really when, when you're talking about a lot of people who make a lot of wreaths is under $30. So that included the shipping and handling. Actually, I didn't have any shipping, shipping and handling, so, you know, I had a $4 discount. But it is from, and I don't get anything by pushing them, but it's not the BB Crafts that you guys buy your die cuts from and stuff. It's another one. And, um, so, anyhow wanted to share that with you if you're in the mood for buying some mesh and I was because I'm getting stir crazy and I'm getting ready to I just want to do something other than summer summer wreath stuff and it doesn't look like we'll be going out anytime soon because oh, my little Elmo fell down because uh, we got a warning here in our county for the COVID because of the parties that were held over the um, 4th of July weekend and the college that has started back up again that has seemed to want to attract younger people into bars and um, they need to close them and the restaurants again and I think that's the next step is those are going to get closed so we're back in the orange or red whatever it is and um, it's, it's uh, depressing and so, anyhow, that's what I'm doing. A whole lot of nothing, really. And um, my husband goes to the doctor today, just his checkup for his hip. And uh, we're going to uh, hopefully get up early in the morning and get out to the next town over to go to the Dollar Tree there and get the things that I need there. The cat food, Catman's doing better. He. He didn't have to go back to the vet, but if he doesn't start going to the bathroom again, he's going to end up going there anyhow. And he's eating and drinking, and he and he's uh, he was wanting to play last night. So anyhow, that's um, that's what's going on in my world. It's hot still. Well, in the 80s, it could be worse. It's supposed to be hot again this weekend. And other than that, I'm not um, just doing a bunch of painting of my sign here that I'm going to hang on the wall somewhere. And um, can't wait to start making Christmas wreaths or fall wreaths. I got to put all this away. Probably should put it away before my husband gets home. <laughs> He's like, oh my God. No, he doesn't get mad, stuff like that unless I really went overboard. But now, none of our, um, which includes the one that I'm not even including this one that we go to every week, I have not found any mesh, period. Not six inch mesh, not 21 inch mesh, none. No mesh, so since this lockdown has occurred, there has been zero mesh anywhere. So you have to order it online and anyhow that's what I do as I go and I'll try to find an online sheet I will keep you guys updated on whatever wreaths I decide to make it'll probably be a fall wreath I'm sick of summer already I wanted to get over with I'm tired of this heat and I'm ready to move on and in the meantime I'm gonna go hopefully to the Dollar Tree and wear my mask because I'm telling you, we are seeing people here not wearing masks, and I will walk out of the store. I literally walked out of the one Dollar Tree the other day because there was two people, including one of the cashiers that didn't have a mask on. 
So I'm out. I'm, I'm wearing mine, you know, and they're supposed to wear theirs, except that I guess Dollar Tree, even though Illinois here makes it, masks are mandatory in all public places, um, Dollar Tree made an announcement a couple days ago and Family Dollar because they own that they're not, it's not a requirement. They are requesting people to make a mask, wear a mask. So mm, I don't like that. I don't like the sound of that. Dollar Tree, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. And and start thinking about your pay, patrons. Go in there and spend money and that are not going to go in there anymore because of your little, you know, mass changing. Here in Illinois, it's not going to change. They're going to get fined if they don't make them. So, anyhow, you guys have a great weekend. Keep cool. And stay safe. All right. Bye-bye.